good morning class 2 i am your computer teacher today we will learning chapter 5 mouse and input device so let's see my next video what is this children can you see on the slide there is a mouse who is jumping around in the field now this mouse is also called as a rat where is it found it is found mostly in our house what is the size of the mouse the size of the mouse is very small it has a long tail and it runs very fast now let's discuss another type of mouse and this type of mouse is called computer mouse which is basically used with the desktop a desktop is a computer which is kept on the table and with the help of keyboard mouse we are able to use and operate the monitor let's see the first picture the first picture shows the example of a computer mouse the size of the mouse is small come to the second picture it has two buttons left and the right and a scroll wheel children can you examine can you see the second picture it shows the two buttons the left and the right button and a scroll wheel which is highlighted with a red circle come to the third picture it has a wire like a tail which is fixed to the cpu cabinet now how do we operate how do we use the mouse with the help of a wire when it is connected with the cpu as it is shown in the third picture we also use a wireless mouse children as the technology is growing the gadgets are also improving with the technology we had seen that a mouse has a long wire which is attached to the cpu but nowadays we also have a wireless mouse also which helps which operates with the help of signal mouse pad the pad on which we move the mouse is known as a mouse pad children when we are able to use the mouse and it is connected to the cpu and when we keep it on the mouse pad it is like a cushion a soft cushion the movement of the mouse the cursor is very smooth so try to use the mouse pad when you are operating the mouse let's see what are the uses of a mouse draw pictures you have drawn pictures on ms paint with the help of mouse i hope you are all practicing at home also point and select any item on the monitor now with the help of the second picture you can see that with the help of the mouse pointer we can point to the particular point and start typing or whatever work we want to do we can do with the help of the mouse pointer you can play games with the help of mouse yes when you are playing games when you want to draw something or when you want to point on anything you can easily do with the help of a mouse types of mouse children we will learn today there are four types of mouse number 1 wide mouse a mouse which has a long tail a long wire which is connected to the cpu in order to work now you can see that there are two buttons left and the right button and also a scroll wheel second wireless mouse now this mouse also has two buttons plus the scroll wheel the only difference is it doesn't have a wire which is connected to the cpu it works with the help of the signal which is being given by the cpu two buttons mouse 
this mouse was the oldest one long back it was used nowadays it is not used but it had two buttons that were the right button and the left button with the invention of the mouse there came also a new feature of a scroll mouse yes this is the fourth type of mouse and in the fourth type of mouse there came a new feature known as the scroll wheel so in the scroll wheel with the help of scroll wheel we also had the two buttons left and the right button now let's see what is a scroll mouse number 1 ball mouse a ball mouse has a ball under it this ball helps to move the mouse pointer on the screen children can you see the first picture in this there is a ball there is a small rubber ball which helps you to helps the mouse pointer to move around the monitor right on the screen so that wherever we want to point it helps us to go to that particular point in the second picture also there is also at a small rubber which helps to move around the monitor but nowadays we don't use this ball mouse we use a new technology mouse and which is a new technology mouse it is the optical mouse i hope you are remembering you use this mouse in the lab it uses light instead of a ball for movement of the mouse pointer now children can you see a small red light and just under the mouse this light helps you to move around the monitor or move around the text move around the screen and you can use it very conveniently so instead of a ball there came a new technology of the light which helps to move around the screen i hope you remember that this mouse you have seen in the computer lab also and at home also you are using the optical mouse let's see let's revise what we had done this is the mouse wire left button right button and this wheel is called the scroll wheel mouse buttons there are two buttons on the mouse the left button and the right button when we click the right mouse button we call it as the right click and when we press the left mouse button we call it as the left click how to hold the mouse place your index finger on the left mouse button place the middle finger on the right mouse button rest your palm on the mouse so students you must have seen that i have provided you a picture where the two fingers that is the index finger the finger which is the first finger of your hand is called the index finger which is placed on the left mouse button and the middle finger is placed on the right mouse button and your palm is rest on the left over mouse so this is how you place your hand on the mouse to hold the mouse right and you can operate it very easily left click pressing the left mouse button twice quickly is called double clicking the finger which is used on the left mouse button is called index finger so in the gif in the video which is provided on the slide you can see that the person is clicking the left mouse button with the help of his index finger and when he presses the left mouse button twice quickly that is called double clicking right click pressing and releasing the right mouse button once is called right clicking 
So in the GIF which is provided to you on the slide, it shows that the middle finger is placed on the right mouse button and when we click it, it is called right clicking. Scroll wheel. It is used to move the page up and down on the monitor. Now children, you can see the scroll wheel is placed in between the left mouse button and the right mouse button. This wheel which can go up and down is called the scroll wheel. Let's see the video which is provided. Now here I am searching about computer history. I want to search about computer. So there is a list of websites which is given and it is showing me all the websites. The content is there and with the help of the scroll wheel, I can move my page up and down very easily and whichever side I want to go, I can click it.